What is up? I'm back. Being comfortable. <laughs> For a new top five. Um, this is going to be... I'm going to start these... Uh, this is will be its own little mini-series for Top 5s, which is pretty cool. And this is um, movies I I hate uh, slash love, but everybody, you know. Movies I hate, everybody loves. And movies I love, everybody hates. Um, this will be starting uh, Movies I Hate, But Everybody Loves, Volume 1. Now, these are movies that I just don't like. I think I don't understand why people love them. I I do understand why people love them. I just don't get it. I think they're friggin' horrible. Um, some of them I I I understand, but I just go I just scratch my head and of course usually laugh at my my movies I love, but my opinion. So let's do this. Number five. <sighs> John Hughes' Curly Sue. It feels disgusting saying that. You have James Belushi being just a weird guy. The annoying brat from Parenthood. Some dumb bitch. Um, Steve Carell wasting his talent at, as a random... Uh, uh, what a waiter guy. Um, oh my god. I just can't stand that. Uh, Curly Sue. I, I just never understood it. And it just saying, just seeing the poster from John Hughes. Or a John Hughes production. John Hughes production. No. No. You, uh, again, you could have directed... Any script, because of the success of uh, Home Alone, and you do this. Uh, number four is Mean Girls. I've talked about this before. It's not that I hate the movie. Well, um, I'm, I kind of do. <laughs> um, the better thing is if they could have had Gretchen and Regina have have something, have something um, because those were the two characters I actually liked not because they were friggin hot as hell but they were characters that I kind of liked like Regina um, I kind of liked uh, I, I liked both characters like both uh, there's just something with both characters I really did like and no you had L Lindsay Lohan's bullshit um, I just didn't really uh, you have Jay Vader's, you have, uh, jo like, um, was in it, uh, future filmmaker. Everybody just gushes over this friggin' movie. I don't know why. I don't ever want to relive high school ever again. If I want to relive high school, I can watch fucking, uh, Better Off Dead. <laughs> or, um, yeah. <laughs> but, um, that's a really good one. Number three is, this is going to be very, very, a big, everyone's going to kill me, but I don't like Citizen Kane. <laughs> I really don't like Citizen Kane. I think Citizen Kane is extremely overrated. Uh, the only thing I like is the, um, between Rosebud, the whole thing, you know, with Orsa, that I did like. Everything else, nah, too boring for me. Not a fan. That's my opinion. Number two, La La Land. I don't like La La Land. I think Emma Stone did not deserve her award. I think um, the producers are complete dickheads because of the thing poor Warren Beatty did. Just be, it really kind of pissed me off. Um, and I'm happy that Moon, wasn't Moonlight, I'm happy that they did win, because it was a better fucking movie. No, I friggin' hate that movie. Friggin' hypocrite. But, um, yeah, La 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 is number two. Number one is a kid's movie. Bolt. Why have Miley Cyrus play a little girl 
I think it's friggin' creepy. John Travolta playing, voicing a dog is really creepy. Um, you have unlikable animals and unlikable people. And uh, just garbage music. Not a fan. Everybody. Even as a kid, I'm like, oh my god. Let's watch Disney's Dinosaur. Let's watch Treasure Planet. Movies I do love and people don't ha like actually hate. I'm going to put Dinosaur probably in Volume 2, but um, Treasure Planet's in there. Uh, my god. I hate this movie. Oh my god. I'd rather watch freaking Frozen. At least Frozen has talent. Bolt? I was... N no, I was never a fan of Bolt. So that was my, my uh, top five movies I hate but everybody loves. I'll see you soon for, um, th for uh, movies I love but everyone hates. See you soon.